Hey guys, today it's a little different. We're gonna shoot a tutorial in the nature uh, by this amazing park that I love to go with Ines and Steven to just walk and enjoy the environment. And during all this time, that was kind of a little escape that was not too far from home. So when I was walking there with them, I was like, oh, it's so nice, it inspires me like those beautiful lime eye makeup. So I have to come back and and do it for you guys. So today was a beautiful day, perfect to create that kind of look. The weather was still super nice, warm with a bit of a breeze. That was a perfect environment and day and weather and feeling and mood <laughs> to do this makeup. So I was very inspired by the sun and all the vegetation around. I'm not a huge fan of wearing green, to be honest with you. It's usually a color that doesn't really fit me. I think it's because of my olive skin. But to add gold in it will change completely the way I can wear it. So that's something that you could think about uh, for yourself as well, if you have the same problem with me. Because then when you turn green into more lime because you added gold toned in it, it changes everything and super beautiful on olive skin. I'm not going to wear too much on my skin, uh, especially that day was pretty hot, so a little bit of concealer under my eye, as usual, that I'm going to pad with my finger. I'm then going to use a brush to really blend the texture so it really feels like it's melting into my skin and just removing the darkness I have under my eyes and then I kind of like brush around my mouth and nose. Then I'm grabbing this blush that I love. It's a very like jelly texture and it's berry. Berry is like usually kind of my favorite color for natural looks because it represents more like the real flush of the skin, like how skin would look like. So that was perfect for me in a very natural mood. And then for eyes, I'm going to start with applying this lime color that is a tiny bit too green for me. That's why I'm going to add the gold. But I want to apply it with my finger so it doesn't look too dawn. It feels a bit more like a halo of color. I'm adding also this other color on top of it to really like bring this brightness to it so it doesn't look too dark. And I'm doing the same now on the other eye. So when I do this sort of halo of color, I concentrate on applying the color in the center of my eyelid and then I'm going to kind of blend it out. And I love when it's a bit more intense in the center and then it starts to fuse with my skin because that's when it really looks like a, like a halo of light. And so I feel like wearing these kind of a gold tones, copper or lime tones like this, it's always super nice to wear in with this technique of halo color. So this is a gold, it's kind of a glittery gold. I'm gonna like pat it again more in the center to really have this like hit of color and then diffuse um, color on my skin. So it's really easy just in the center and, just, and then I just pad to make sure it's blended well and that it's really recreating this halo effect. I like to put a bit in the inner corner of the eyes as well. Um, then mascara to make sure that the lash line is very dark because when I do bright colors like this on my eyes if I don't have some darkness by my lash line I've noticed like it makes my eye kind of like erased so the mascara very black on the roots of the lash line it's very important for my look to look like I'm still there you know I'm, I'm wearing my makeup my makeup is not wearing me so I'm gonna add a bit more blush. I felt like I kind of wanted to have this like pink effect, like I just ran a little bit into the field. <laughs> and I'm gonna apply some a bit on my lips and that's it. So super natural look with a touch of berry tones um, and just mascara. That's it. I feel like I'm blending pretty well in the nature. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. More videos are coming over. It's very exciting to see this video we shot during 
summer being posted now during September to kind of carry this summer spirit a little bit longer. I'm not ready to say goodbye to summer yet. I'll see you next week. <laughs>